Now what? I found a note back there. Had some codes on it. It says there's a WLF safe house at some place called Saravina Base. Saravina. So we find it? Hopefully we find our first WLF. Get them to talk. Go from there. Let's do it. Oh shit, look. Saravina Hotel. Well, that's gotta be it. That's where we need to get. Okay. Let's find a way past this, uh, fuck Fedra gate. Very creative. Gets right to the point. Let's get closer and scope it out. Do you know the code? That note I found has a bunch of them. But we need to get power to the gate first. This is East 2. Five, three, four, five. Okay, but I think we first need to find power for it. Out of gas. God damn it. Well, Need gasoline for this. Oh shit. The note. What? The note mentioned that there's gas in the courthouse garage and the dome. Alright. Courthouse garage and the huh? dome. So what's the plan for finding these places? We ride around and see what we see. You think Tommy came through here? But he did. So, where are we? Pretty sure we're here. Ah, uh, nice. I'll mark it up as we go. What the hell happened out here? I'm guessing the military bombed the shit out of this place. Why would they do that? Well, they would sometimes destroy parts of the city that were lost to the infected. Or to rebels. That seems like overkill. Well, it usually worked. On the infected or the rebels? Both fuel distribution. Here we go. <laughs> Fedra secured the shit out of this place. Boston always had food shortages. Hungry people get desperate. In the first game, there was a point where Joel, his friend Tess, and Ellie were moving through a city that was also bombed. Tess mentions to Ellie the exact same things that Ellie now mentions to Dina. So it's a cool nod to the first game. Okay, I just got a stun bomb. Could be useful. Let's get back in there. Ration distribution center. In Boston, we'd line up for blocks. And the food sucked. I go crazy. Come on, let's find a way in. 
Can you get through? All right, I got you. to take this guy out. Let's see if we can find a way to get close to him. Never peaceful with these guys. Close. I think that's all of them. I don't get it. If there were still people around, they would have cleared this place out. Maybe they didn't make it here. Yeah, maybe. Let's find that gas. Seems quiet. Hey, Ellie. This place is a synagogue. How can you tell? Uh, one, there are menorah decorations on the wall. It's a Jewish thing. And two, I didn't burst into flames just now, so... Burst into flames? It's just a dumb joke. Oh, unlike your other ones? You shut it. Okay. Uh, 
<sighs> Found the gas. Here we go. <sighs> God damn it. Hey, language. House of worship. It's empty. That sucks. Now what? <sighs> we'll try our luck at the courthouse garage. Let's get out of here. Okay, you were saying? Yeah, so this place brings back a lot of memories. My sister used to drag me to a synagogue all the time. Do you still pray? Sometimes. Really? When? I said when we leave up Jackson. I said when at Joel's grave. Sometimes I just say little ones to myself. Does it help? I think it calms me. It helps me put things in perspective. To way to deal with grief, a way to show respect. It's what I know. Is there some way to open these doors? Bet we could use that. This way, right behind me. Hmm. Hey, what are you doing? I bet I can get to the other balcony with this. Um, okay. Ellie, careful. It's okay. It's holding. It's the same mechanics as in Uncharted 4. Monday now. Right. <laughs> okay, cross the dome off the list. Let's go find the courthouse. It might be worth grabbing some supplies before we press on. It's peaceful out here, at least. It's weird being in a QZ and not hearing trucks. Or gunfire and explosions. My sister always avoided QZs. That's probably why. She just got more and more paranoid. She'd sometimes wake up screaming in the middle of the night. That's rough. We always had a backpack so we could bail if something happened. Never stayed in one place for more than a few weeks. It sucked. <laughs> it's nice to have a place we call home, right? Yeah. When I first got to Jackson, I was so overwhelmed by all the people. I was overwhelmed by all the food. I remember my first week just gorging myself. Stuffing food in all my pockets for later like it was gonna run out. I saw that. You did not. I did. I remember thinking, who is this string bean girl stealing all the jerky? <sighs> I didn't steal that much jerky.
Jotting this down. Looks like that's everything over here. Upgrading the revolver. <laughs> 